Warning, some viewers may be too serious to enjoy the following video. Yo, what's up, dudes? I just got off work and I'm gonna go ride roller coasters. But this isn't a normal day. I'm actually very close to a milestone. So as of currently, my coaster count is 496. And we all know what number that is very close to, 497. Yes, I'm almost at 500 coasters. There's actually a few coasters in New Jersey that I've not ridden. I just never bothered to ride them because I just thought they were trash. Credit to credit, I gotta ride some rides. I gotta get to 500, so uh, we're gonna make this happen. So I'm currently leaving Trenton, New Jersey. I'm headed over to Mount Laurel to go to Funplex, which is a small park that I've never bothered to go to because they have one coaster built by SBF Visa, and I despise SBF Visa for some reason. If you had to hate a coaster company, that's the one I hate. I don't know why, I just hate that company. I'm headed to Funplex, which is about like a half hour from my job, and that will be 497, so that'll be my 497th coaster. Hopefully it's open, pray to the gods, leave a comment down below praying that it's open, hopefully it is. And then after that, I'm going to suffer and go to Clementson Amusement Park, and I'm gonna go on their two coasters there, which will put me at 499 leaving my 500th coaster to be something special. Now, there's a variety of coasters that I could make my 500th coaster, and I'm not really sure yet, so comment down below what you think my 500th coaster will be. I'll just say Seal Curtain is obviously one that could be my 500th coaster. It's brand new, I haven't ridden it yet, and it's not too far away from me. I could easily go there in a day and go ride. But we'll see, time will tell, the video will tell you. Keep watching, you'll find out. Okay, so I'm at Funplex, but I gotta change out of these work clothes, these whack work clothes into whatever typical outfit that El Toro Ryan usually wears at a theme park. I'm gonna do that thing where I snap my fingers like every other YouTuber. And I'll be in my new outfit. Ah, oh, where are my clothes? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, I, I did it. Comment down below if that was cringe. All right, let's go to the park. So there's a coaster I need to ride. It was pretty easy. All I did was I walked in, I asked for a card with enough money for the roller coaster, and it's only $6, so I was like, hell yeah, sign me up. All right, so I'm hopped on. I got a car with my friends right here. What's up, dude? Locking them in. Okay, make sure they're nice and secure. Sweet. All right, we're gonna go on this SBF Wild Mouth spinner too. I see the other car spinning over there. I know nothing about this park or anything, but it actually it's pretty adequate here. There's a huge water park over there. They said I could film on the ride as long as I don't drop my phone. So yeah, I won't drop it, man. I got it. So we're gonna do a nice reverse POV here at Funplex on my 497th roller coaster. Stay over, pick it up, not break that. I think it's called Fun Coaster. With all my friends. It's like there's a trim on the train. It's like not even happening. All right, here's the drop. That was satisfying. Trim brakes, good. You get set. Another drop. Yeah, not really satisfying. This, this thing's a credit. Maybe it'll start spinning. Oh, here it comes. Woo. Woo. So lonely. Yeah, it sucks. This is terrible. The park's nice though. If you're ever in the area, if you live near Mount Laurel, this kind of reminds me of like, um. I'm all into the tunnel right here, but I used to have a place around my house that's kind of like this. I didn't have a coaster though. Oh, it breaks. Oh, cool. Okay, I can leave now. <laughs> this is how I felt about Fun Coaster. This is what it made me do. Super big arcade here. So if you can come here and you want to spend your money, come here. Uh, no, all the money is. So yeah, if you need a quick, easy credit, come here to Funplex in Mount Laurel, New Jersey. You can get a quick, easy credit for six dollars. Be in and out in ten minutes, just like me. On to more coasters. Just gonna send it. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, so first Camden Park L is that they charge for parking here. Ten dollars. Kind of sucks that I'm gonna be here for so little. You know, I'm not gonna be here for a long time, but whatever. It's for the it's for the journey to 500 coasters. I gotta do what I gotta do. And luckily though, there is a W here, and that Hellcat's open. So I saw it cycling. Hopefully their SBF Visa coaster, whatever their kitty coaster is running, so I can get the 4.99. So let's send it. 
So I actually came to Camden Park once in the sixth grade during summer camp and I hated it. Nothing was open, Hellcat was closed, they had another ride roller coaster here back then that was close too. I honestly thought I would never come back here. Credit to credit man, I need, I need that credit. So I'm gonna start with this one right here. So I got on the kitty coaster and asked her if she could cycle it one time. Cycled it three times because there's a bunch of screaming kids on it. So you gotta do what you gotta do, but I got the credit. Now I'm gonna go on Hellcat. I was here in 2007 when I was in my summer camp. It was close, so finally get my credit, man. It's gonna send it. They said I could film too, so screw it. Yeah, it's my first ride ever on Hellcat. They asked me why I was getting in the back seat, and I was like, I want some airtime. They were like, that's the roughest one. And I figured the ride's gonna be rough regardless, so I'm just gonna get in the roughest seat and experience this ride in its full glory on my first ride ever on this thing. Let's see how many trim brakes engage, and hopefully I don't drop my phone, because I'm actually kind of scared. This, this ride's actually kind of rough. But I'm gonna do it again. Okay, I'm in the front row now. Let's see if this is any better. I don't really have high hopes. Of it. There you go. Which would be like. This ride's a piece of work, holy sh**. Well, they put new track on the uh, turnaround on the brake run at least, not anywhere else though. You know what, this ride sucks. I really don't like it, but I paid to marathon this ride and no one's here, so f it, I'm gonna marathon it. I don't care. I'm the only one on the train because no one else likes this track. You know, believe it or not, Alan Schilke actually designed this roller coaster. This is an SNS wooden coaster, but whoever built it built it like. Ah, uh, why am I doing this to myself? Okay, ride number four. I'm already exhausted. This never happens. We're just gonna send it. I'm not excited to send it. We're just gonna send it. I paid for this. I'm riding it. Thirty dollars. Twenty dollars get in the park. Ten dollars park. So I'm gonna ride this one. Oh my god. I paid for it. I'm going on it again. I want to do one more ride. I'm going to do it in the roughest seat on the coaster. I'm not going to film this one because it's too crazy and I'm just going to try to enjoy it. Yeah. I need to take a nap, man. That was like a boxing match. I've been on a lot of coasters, 499 now. <laughs> that was probably the roughest one I've ever been on, without a doubt. You still have to try it though, definitely try it out, but you're, you're gonna you're gonna have a miserable time, just like I did in the videos you already saw. Nothing can stop me. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. I don't even know if I'm gonna film it off ride. Like, I don't feel good. And I have an hour and a half drive back to my house. I was gonna try to film it off ride. I got like two clips. One of the clips fucked up. No, this ride doesn't deserve it. No, I'm, I'm, they have to retract it first and then I'll film it off ride. Retract your coaster. All right, I take back that statement. They have retracted parts of it and all eight layers. So that's pretty dope. They just gotta get to the rest of it, hopefully soon. Apparently you can't ride the log flume by yourself. Is that a thing? I don't know. I'm, I'm going home. I'm tired. Bust down, Tatiana. Bust down, Tatiana. I want to see you bust down. Pick it up, not break that shit. Get down.
break it down, speed it up, then slow that shit down on the gas, slow it down, bust it, bust it down, bust it. All right, well, I don't think I'm ever coming back here again. That was different. Um, I mean, it's a cool park for what it is. But that coaster's rough, man. But it has potential. Like, if they had less trim brakes and more, like, actual track. Um, like, just cut this But, like, if it, had, if it was an actual smooth ride, it'd be good. So I'm at 499 coasters now. I think I just rode the world's roughest wooden coaster, maybe. I don't know. At least the roughest coaster I've been on. I'm gonna try to get my 500th coaster. Let's see what I can do. A few moments later. Okay, guys, I'm so excited. I'm about to ride my 500th roller coaster. Like, I literally just, like, I can't even. I don't know what's going on. Like, this is years in the making. Years in the making right now. I'm about to go on my 500th roller coaster. Like, that's such clout levels there that, like, no one has. Like, oh, my God. That's, people are going to be so impressed. No one's going to give it. I really wanted to make this one special, so it's going to be a special ride. That's for sure. I came a long way here, a whole 15 minutes away from my house to ride this roller coaster. It's just been a long long thing it's i honestly like i could have ridden this ride years ago but not really i mean it's near my house but it's so expensive to get in here it's like a few thousand dollars just to park and then admissions like another few thousand dollars luckily though i got i found this coupon yesterday so i can get um so i can buy a 200 ticket book and receive 100 tickets free because the, the ride costs like it's like five thousand tickets or something so this will help me get part of the way there going on this um intamin looping star t-rex ride and it's gonna slap i can't wait it's gonna be a good one guys i'm just praying it's open um, it is a very exclusive park, so sometimes they will only open that ride if people pay a little extra money to get on. So I'm just waiting here to see if someone else will do it for me, just over there in the background. It, it's that it's that ride over there. I'm just hoping someone will pay for it so that it can start running and then I can go on. Because I don't want to pay the, the starting fee for that. It's like $10,000 to get that thing started. Okay, guys, I'm in the fabulous Keensburg Amusement Park. Uh, here's another credit over here. I actually have this ride. I rode this in like 2000. I was like five years old, so I have this credit. This is part of my 500. But now I need this this uh, Intamin ride over here. This it looks maybe RMC. It looks like they're inspecting it now. Maybe they're get, they heard I was coming, so they're gonna get it ready for me. I'm, I'm so pumped, guys. This is gonna be lit. My good good 500 coaster. This is probably gonna be the best 500 coaster ever for anyone anyone out there. This will beat their 500 coaster for sure. Here's actually the first test run of the day. I'm so excited, guys. This, this ride's gonna be so good. The park opened at 12. It's like 12.30 right now. They're just getting it started with the, te the uh, test runs and inspections and stuff. Good timing on Keensburg's part, you know? The first test run's going up right now. Great first test run, that's for sure. All right, we back in business. What a great looking roller coaster. Probably like the best in New Jersey. Sorry, El Toro. All right, it sounds marvelous. Oh yeah, that's a little loop. I hear Alan Shilke designed this one. Alright guys, looks like the ride's all set to go. They did all their test runs, I think. I bought the uh, 5,000 tickets it takes to get on. Cost me so much money. If you guys could watch this ad right now, that would be greatly appreciated. Just to help forward for these 5,000 tickets it takes to get on. This nice intimate RMC, uh, Gerslauer, um roller coaster. It's gonna be slapped, my 500th, I can't wait. Uh, it looks like I gotta wait for a ride operator now. Uh, maybe I can run it myself, maybe I'll figure out a way to do that, but I just gotta get on this thing, my 500 coaster. It's a big deal. While we wait for the ride to open, we can look at the stats here to see how, uh, how much money you have to have in your bank account to ride. So this is uh, $49 million that you cannot ride this ride. If you have at least between 49 million and 56 million, you have to ride with an adult, but you can go on. And then if you have over 56 million, then you have, then you can ride and you're good. So that's what it took to get on this ride. It took me years to save up for that. So here I'm looking at the uh, inspection sticker of the ride. It looks like it was last inspected in 2018 and it actually expired on December 31st, 2018. Luckily it's only like 2017 right now, so that should be good. It shouldn't matter. That's not illegal, right? It should be good. I I'm safe, right? Right? Okay, we've got some progress here. They just moved that little gate over there, so I might be able to get on. I don't think I could film this ride because right over here it says you must remove all hats, cell phones, electronics, all that nonsense. So I can't film this one probably, but it's gonna slap my 500 roller coaster. I 
just got off my 500th roller coaster. <laughs> um, that was probably my number one. That was probably the best roller coaster I've ever been on. Super comfortable, super good leg room, no head banging whatsoever, lots of ejected air time. It did actually have ejected air time on the drop right here because it's so, so weird. So yeah, I've been on 500 roller coasters. Can you believe that? You know, you know, you know how many people are gonna be impressed by that? No one. Oh, it's great, dude, it's so dope. Yeah, this ride was terrible. It's, it's awful, it's a little rough. Uh, I just thought this would be a, fu a funny 500th roller coaster because it's 50 minutes from my house. I've never bothered to ride it because it's so trash. That's probably one of the worst roller coasters I've ever been on. I like banged my knees on the first drop because the cars are so tiny. But I've been on 500 roller coasters. A lot of people like to make their 500 roller coasters something like super dope or something super like like high tier, high status. But nah, I went on the Penfari Looper as my 500 roller coaster. My life's content, my life's complete. I think Elon Musk already saw this and he's gonna send me a, a Tesla Model X P100D maxed out. So I'm excited for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Peace out.